Have you ever stopped to think about how those massive airplanes get fueled up so fast? It's not just a random guy with a garden hose out there on the tarmac. The real magic happens thanks to an incredible, often overlooked system called the Fuel Hydrant Network. Let's dive into how it works and why it's such a game changer for aviation. Beneath the airport surface, hidden under the concrete where planes, taxi, and passengers stroll, lies a sprawling web of underground pipes. These pipes act like a city's secret arteries, silently transporting millions of gallons of jet fuel across the airport. This invisible network links massive storage tanks, some capable of holding 10 million gallons or more, to small, unassuming hydrant pits located at every gate. You've probably walked right over these little covers without a second thought, but when a fuel truck or cart hooks up to one, it's like tapping into an underground river of high-octane energy. So how does the fuel get there in the first place? It starts with deliveries to the airport, often via pipelines, snaking from refineries, or through fleets of trucks and even ships for coastal hubs. Once it arrives, the jet fuel is stored in enormous tanks, where it's carefully filtered to remove impurities, because the last thing a plane needs is dirty fuel at 30,000 feet. From there, Powerful pumps push it through the hydrant system at high pressure, ready to flow whenever a plane rolls up. At the gate, the action happens fast. Workers connect a heavy-duty hose from the hydrant pit or a specialized fuel truck directly to the aircraft's wing. The flow rate is insane, up to 1,000 gallons per minute for a jumbo jet like a Boeing 747, which can hold 50,000 gallons. The whole process takes less than an hour. This efficiency keeps flights on time, cuts operational costs, and ensures safety. Next time you're boarding, glance down at the tarmac. You're standing on an engineering marvel that powers the skies. Isn't that wild? 